Hey guys, it's Nelson with Galaxy Note 2 Softmodder, and today I'm going to show you how to send secure text messages on your Galaxy Note 2. And here I have also my Galaxy Note 3. So I'm going to show you guys between these two phones how to send secure text messages. So CyanogenMod has recently teamed up with another company, a third party company that specializes in um, secure text messages and phone calls. And they're going to now implement that into their stock ROM. CyanogenMod has over like 10 million uh, users, but you have to have Rue and it's difficult to install if you're not very um, well tuned into how to do that kind of stuff. So I'm going to show you guys how to do it with your stock ROM and you don't have to be rooted or anything. So the first thing you want to do is head over to the Play Store. The application is called Text Secure. And I already have it installed on both devices. You'll need to have it installed on both devices because that's the only way you can send encrypted messages. So make sure both, like if your device and any person that you're sending text messages to has to have the application as well. So I'm going to open it up. And here, I'm connected with this phone already. So I'm, um, okay, so I'm aborting my secure session because I already had a secure session. So now this, it's just a regular conversation, so I'm going to send anything, and I'm going to send it to this one. Okay, I'm aborting secure session too. So I just sent a text message to this one, and there it is. And this, um, this is not secure yet. But what you can do now is go up here, and there's a lock that you'll see. You can press it, and it says start secure session. And it'll ask you if you want to initiate secure session with Usher, which is the other phone number that I have on here. And I'll put yes. And here at the bottom, you'll notice that, okay, now you can see that there's a key and then there's a lock here now on the, on the send sign. So that means that your text messages are now secure. So if I send anything, okay, I send a text message back and here it is and this text message will now be encrypted and I'll send another text back here okay and it okay what this means is that the over the air the text messages will be encrypted and each text message is encrypted with a special key so what that means is that if that's somehow bypassed you'll they'll only um, whoever is trying to look into your text messages will only be able to see one of your text messages and not every single text message because they each have a unique key and I'll show you guys what it looks like what the text messages look like um, from from the uh, this is from Google Hangout so you can see that there's just a bunch of words um, and that's the key so that's the only thing they can see and here's a normal text message that I sent without it being secure and then yeah it's just loads of words and it's pretty um it makes it very difficult for others to see your text messages um you can also mess with settings well you can get out of here go back to text secure and you can uh, uh actually because you'll need a at the beginning of the application when you first start it you'll need to enter a passphrase which you'll need to get into the application so you can do that i'm going to clear passphrase and you can put stuff in there and um whoa and then okay let's see over here uh you can go to settings as well and there'll be a few settings where you can do um how you want um your text messages here to be stored um you can change the led color uh, the pattern the sounds that you receive like the typical text message kind of things you can change um input settings you can change the theme you can have um the device delete uh, old messages after a certain while, changing the passphrase, all those things. So yeah, it's a really good way, you know, I mean, especially with what's been going on recently with government spying and all those things, um, you can now have a very a great security system on your stock Galaxy Note 2 without having to be root or your Galaxy Note 3 um, and without having CyanogenMod. All right, well, that's it. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Galaxy Note 2 Softwater. All right, thanks.